Hello, this is Chris Minnick with Webucator. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a pop-up or modal with pure CSS. This video was inspired by a blog post by Shakir Rahman, which is available at the URL shown here. Creating pop-ups with CSS has a couple advantages over using JavaScript or jQuery. First, it won't slow down your website while loading the JavaScript. And second, it will work even if JavaScript is disabled in the user's browser. The disadvantage to this technique is that it won't work in some older browsers that don't support the CSS3 animation and transition properties, as well as the target pseudo class. The pop-ups in this tutorial are designed to be as simple and friendly as possible for the user. The first example is a manual pop-up. This will appear when a user clicks a button. Shakir demonstrates two versions of this pop-up in his blog post one with a light color scheme and one with a dark color scheme. All of the code can be copied from the tutorial. Here's the demo. The second kind of pop-up is one that opens automatically when a web page is accessed. These are useful for product promotions, ads, subscription forms, and so forth. These should be used wisely in order to minimize the annoyance to the user. Here's the demo. In the automatic pop-up, we use CSS3 animation for the transition effect, whereas in the manual pop-up, we use CSS3 transition. If you want to learn more about CSS3 animations and transitions, you can download the whole demo file by clicking the download link in the blog post here. In his post, Shakir also gives instructions for installing his CSS3 pop-ups on Blogger or on a self-hosted WordPress site by copying his code and pasting it into your template. Here's how to install it in WordPress. First log into your dashboard and then go to Appearance Editor. Select your theme. and then select the header PHP file. Copy the CSS from the blog post and then paste it into the style element. If there isn't already a style element, you'll need to create one first. Next, copy the HTML and paste it into the body of your template. And then click Update File. If you only want the pop-up to appear on the home page, you should paste the HTML into the index.php file instead of header.php. I hope you found this video useful. Thanks again to Shakir for the inspiration. Check out his blog at the URL shown here for other articles related to WordPress and web development.